hot news it took everything for the Patriots to come out on top in a wild AFC championship game. Perspective interpretation of the news based on evidence, including data, as well as anticipating how events might unfold based on past events. Kansas City, MOU The fervor of the hometown fans painted this frozen brown tundra red U and not just any red, either, but a bold primary color, the most vivid red imaginable, the kind of red that came from a heart artery. Even the opera, but all that red became the color of heartbreak because this AFC championship game turned on a coin flip in overtime that put the ball in the hands of Tom Brady and the Drably immortal New England Patriots. That's what it came down to after all the things overturned and squandered, the weird switchbacks in momentum and penalty-aided drives, the spectacular snaring catches and tipped ball interceptions, and above all the sorcery of that man in red, Patrick Mahomes, who spun things out of nothing to rally his Chiefs from a 10-point deficit in the fourth quarter. That quarter rendered New England was a defiant and uncannily tough outfit, an organization that managed to feel as if the odds were stacked against us, as Brady said, even though it will be going to its ninth Super Bowl since he was drafted in 2000 and has been playing for championships for my entire life pretty much, the 23-year-old Mahomes said. The Patriots back, it wasn't a great game. It was a strange, they went at two different paces, in two different styles. Mahomes was quick, Brady, by contrast, was sedate, unhurried and unhassled, even as he weathered two interceptions and the game's major reversals and the Chiefs' comebacks time and again. The Patriots had, but in the second half, Mahomes performed like the genius kid who cribs for the test and gets an A. The Chiefs came out of the tunnel to score so quickly that it snatched the breath out of your throat, Mahomes covering the final 6-6 six, six yards in just two plays through the air. The kid was a show, the teams combined for six scores in the fourth quarter, including four in the final 332. After so many debatable plays and arguable events, it came down to that coin toss. As soon as it came, that unhurried rhythm of Brady's took over again. You got any touch, I do, McDaniels answered. But it was Brady who made the calls work who stood there so composedly three times on third and ten, only to unfurl those languid-seeming throws, two to Julian Edelman and one to Rob Gronkowski, before Rex Burke had finally finished the thing off with his two-yard punch into the end zone. It's in his DNA, Edelman said. If there is a clutch, what Mahomes and Brady had in common from their opposite ends of the age spectrum was their wholeheartedness, their heedless exhaustion of themselves. That was worth read more NFL coverage. Jerry Brewer A. Please enter a valid email address. By submitting your email, you agree to our end. We sent this offer to John Smith at gmail.com.